I started teaching my siblings. I was always looking for validation. An average job was not what I wanted. There were a couple of years there where I really debated dropping out of engineering school. Immigrating to Canada as a teenager from Iran, it was definitely challenging for me. It's kind of like going to a party every day. The things that I work with doctors doing, why can't I do them? And the gratitude that we got from these villagers just like kept sticking with me. You get to kind of be there in the middle of these big challenging moments in people's lives. So I am a hairdresser. I teach economics. I am a registered dental hygienist. I get to help people understand what they're about. I'm a notary public. I am a hairdresser. I am a pharmacist. I am an engineering consultant. I have been a nurse for 43 years now. I wish somebody had talked to me and said, you can get through it. You need to pick a career that you're gonna be happy during the work for. I was quite confident that I knew everything there was to know about everything. Having the ability to try something and maybe fail, but go back and try it again and succeed. And I don't think I could have reached where I am right now on my own. If you are clear about what matters to you, your why you're doing something, it is going to drive you through the tough times it's okay to not know where you want to go in life. If you really work hard for it, um, sooner or later you're going to get to where you want to be.